Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I am showing a small exercise for pipe, uh, how to draw the above ceiling pipes uh, and uh, some coordination, um, how to we can do, do it in a rivet. So I'll go here the system. So I need to draw some pipes. First you can go to here the pipe. Then you can choose the, uh, like uh, from here you can choose the uh, which kind of pipe you need from the system types you can choose the whichever uh, pipe you need so you can uh, choose from here for example i am just uh, using like a, uh, some other hydraulic supply or ten whichever you need okay for example domestic cold water so from here i can choose the diameter for the pipe then the elevation i can give uh, from here I, for example i am just giving 2800 then I just need to draw the uh, pipe like this, but it is not showing, right? So what the happen? You can type VV, then go to the filter. Then you can just uh, turn on this visibility from here. So it will be show over there. Just click OK and uh, just give a fine. And it was not showing over here, right? So just go to view range, then change this one to uh, this is first floor, right? So I need to change this one to second floor. Then I can say like this one 4000, uh, just say like 4000 uh, view range, then click OK. So you can see that pipe was showing, showing over here. So other than that, uh, you can see the 3D view uh, that was how it look in the 3D view. Just go to the this one. So you can see the pipe was showing like this, the both ceiling. So if you want to make it a little bit up, you can make it uh, the up up the this uh, elevation so i'm just saying like 3000 so i'll show you some coordinations also so it is actually it is clashing with the um clashing with i'm just giving shader slash clashing with this uh, structural uh, beams uh, then we can just reducing that one 2850 up to here then i just need to draw another kind of pipes create similar so i'm this is cold water then domestic hot water okay so just i need to draw the another pipe like this just drawing like that so you can you can see the 3d view it was looking like this and you can give the filter also over here the color which one you need so you can add it that one domestic cold water and uh, domestic hot water just apply that one and give a pattern for example, uh, domestic cold water, you need a solid fill like uh, the color is blue. You can give that color. Click OK. Then here you can say like uh, um, I need another color red. Hot water. You can just give that one. Apply. OK. So you can see it, this was uh, showing, showing 3D like that. And the line thickness you can give like this. OK. So another that uh, the two pipe we created, I'm just moving up to here, this two one, and here also I just <clears throat> giving this much gap. You can um, run another pipes also here. So how to draw that one? So I'm, I'm just using another kind of pipe, uh, like a fire protection dry. Then just uh, draw another pipe over here, like this, and I need to just to draw the pipe. So I just need to be move up to here. Okay, it is going uh, on this way. I'm just going to move this one pipe over here. Okay, then then another kind of pipe. So just uh, create similar fire protection dry and uh, just need to be wet pipe also. You can make it so just to make another pipe over here. So the, the diameter you can change it from here. Okay, so I'm just uh, given a practice like uh, how to draw the pipes in above ceiling. Then you can just uh, move up to here. And you can go see it in the 3D view how it's look. So it is going perfectly on here. And two pipes are going like that. And if you want to um, make this uh, um, a filter over here, you can go to filter and you can add the filter also. So just go to here. Uh, we will have a fire protection wet on this one. So just add that one. So I'm just uh, dry and wet. You need to add that one and you need to give the uh filter for that this time giving filter for that uh, we can say like uh, red click ok ok and uh, here also you can give the another color click ok 
pattern also if you need to give pattern so you can give the patterns for that one just leave a red color you can give it that one click ok and here also you can give the color of the red and uh, the patterns solid fill just click ok apply so you can see that two pipes are come up over here if you don't want to show this uh, um, uh, uh, this filter from here you can just uh, uh, no clear override override so just to give here also clear override click ok apply then it will show like this different color you can use it okay so another color i think uh, better to give another color just you go to green um, green color for this one and this one we can say like uh, magenta or some other color click ok just giving okay click okay so it will come like that if you give the thick line so it will show like that yeah it, it will if you want to if you want to show it in 3d view so you can implement it that one also we over here the uh, um, the uh, that two uh, dry and wet over here so just to give a solid fill just give a solid fill and color we can say like uh, green click OK and this one we can say like uh, another color just uh, click OK and solid fill so that too you can uh, read in over in the uh, over uh, over in the 3d view itself right so this was uh, coming like this so you need to do some branches for this pipe so you can uh, simply draw the branches like this create similar and if you want to Draw the pipe up to here so you can uh, do it that one and it automatically that uh, fitting will be taken and uh, from here you just need to make a branch for this one but it will be clashing with the, this pipe okay definitely it will clash with this pipe so for that uh, we just need to be adjust something so if you if you look in the 3d view of this one so you will be get a clash over there right it is clashing with each pipe so in that case, what you can do, uh, you just need to adjust the height of uh, this pipe, any one of the pipe. So I'm just uh, splitting this one pipe from here to here. I'm just uh, splitting. SL is the split command. So I'm just uh, splitting from here, this two. And then uh, you can just uh, rise up this uh, pipe. Okay. For example, I'm just uh, selecting this one. I need to change this one to 3,000, uh, so it will it will going up right so the elevation is changed from here so you can see here it was changed right then you can uh, join these two uh, pipes uh, simply like uh, i'll just uh, selecting this pipe just uh, draw, uh, connecting to this one automatically the when when will the pipe when will be come up over there so this is a small exercise like you can do it uh, by fittings and everything so it was going like this right so then uh, then this this one need to be the same level so just need to split it this one so we can uh, done it in a one support so select this pipe and take the elevation for this one and you can just give the elevation uh, whichever uh, elevations you require so just give like that and you can just connect it to this pipe together so that is the one method so then you need to adjust this uh, uh, this one near to the pipe you can see clearly the pipe is going uh, going up and uh, it is uh, down to the connecting to other one and you can uh, make this uh, here from here you can make it riser also uh, it is going it's, it need to be going up so you can just make a sections take sections from here and uh, just go to view just going to the view and you can just find it this one just give a fine and here you can change the uh, scale i'll just say like 25 so then if you want to make it up uh, this one upward uh, you can make the riser also for this pipe right okay so just uh, I, I need to make it uh, up to there uh, draw pipe so then you can just make the uh, pipe wherever you require and uh, you, you want to see that when it is automatically uh, showing the uh, the pipe going up upside and everything and you can see the pipe uh, uh, fittings also here it is rising up it is showing like a rising up the, the the pipe okay so like that you can it, you can show it that one the same thing you can implement it over here on this pipe also you can make it that one um, you can just show this one also draw pipe and then it will be draw draw like this so in the, in the 3d itself you can see that uh, that was rising up right 
and um, uh, for example these pipes also need uh, some branches over here connecting to this riser for example i am considering this one is as a riser so i just need to move this pipe uh, 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 near to this area so i'm just selecting this up to here i can place that uh, to riser and this one also you can just move it to here okay for example i need to uh, branch this uh, this one also here so just i need to make the create similar then i just want to uh, uh, draw the pipe over here so what will happen it is going up to here i need to stick it in the 3d how it's look so i'm just uh, creating similar for other one and i'm just uh, doing up to here the another pipe so if you look in the 3d view so what are the clashes you can see there it just show there you can see all the pipe is clashing with other pipe right so just need to stretch up to here that you can clearly see the 3d view how it's uh, going and uh, connect it is clashing with other pipes right so what is what is the solution for this one we can change the elevations for these two pipe need to be run over here i'm just splitting from here okay just uh, i split it over one line one pipe from here just uh, split it from here deleting and i'm uh, just uh, splitting up to here and here also i need to split it right i need to i need to make it this one up and uh, just uh, deleted that deleted that then what we can do i need to just rise up this one right i just need to give a 3000 okay for this one so you can see it was uh, it was a little bit clashing again so i'm just giving 3100 uh that will not clashing yeah this clashing with this one also so i can say like a 3050 so the clash will be avoided and then uh, you can just uh, go to top top view and uh, connecting with uh, this one to here so you can connect it like that but it is not connecting okay so i'm just uh, trying with this one it will be it was not connecting because uh, they are required some um, more height so i'm just uh, splitting up to from here just uh, splitting this one I'm just uh, deleting this one okay from here also i'm just deleting I just want to uh, make it a little more higher. Okay, so I'm just say like uh, 3,200. Okay, uh, then what we can do it just need to be uh, connecting these two two pipes. So just selecting this one. I'm just connecting this one. So it will be uh, it will be like uh, it is it is connecting to uh, the pipe. So stretch this section up to here. Then uh, go to this view. The 3D itself, you can do these things, right? Just uh, need to be make like that. Just uh, move this one a little bit, avoid the clashes. Okay. Then go to this uh, plan also. You can go it and you can do it in the plan itself. So just selecting this one and uh, draw like this. So it will it will connect it like that. Okay. So it it can be do like that and then um, just uh, need to be um, make it we need to connect these two lines right these two pipes so what you can do it you can make it like this and stretch up to here so it is connecting like that but the problem is like you know you are not able to uh, connect like that so just need to be higher this pipe okay so i just need to hire the uh, elevations for this one just say <clears throat> 3100 then you just need to select uh, connect this two line two pipes right from here to here so maybe it was small distance so you cannot connect it that too okay so in that cases you can do one thing we can go to here and make one sections okay just to make uh, make one sections over here for this pipe just make one section go to view and uh, you see this was this was very sh small right <coughs> Sorry for that, and uh, just need to be go it stretch this one a little bit up like this. Okay, so then what we can do, we can move it to this uh, uh, pipe upside and just uh, draw pipe connecting like this, connecting up to here and connect it like this. Okay, so it will be come up over here again. Again, we need to split this one because it is going to touching with slabs, right? So I'm just uh, split this, splitting this one. So use the uh use this all uh split commands for this one and section also you can use it for making the pipe uh, uh, and everything and create similar just uh, draw the pipe like this 
and connected like that. So that that is also avoiding for this clashing with this beams, right? They can put it up uh, over here. When in the 3D view, you can see uh, there will be um, uh, there will be any clashes or not. You can check it, right? So you can clearly clearly avoided the clashes for these pipes, right? You can just uh, avoid the pipe like that. And uh, this thing you can make it like the here itself. So no worry, just uh, move it up to here. So it is it is blowing clearly that like that. So another one, another pipe also it is clashing with other pipe, right? This red pipe it is clashing. So just need to be uh, avoid that clash also. Um, so how to avoid that clashes? Uh, we can make some sections over here. Before that, you just need to split that one. I just want to split that area also. So I'm splitting this this one over here and over here. So just uh, deleting this one, deleting this one and uh, if you go to the 3D view, you can see that was uh, changed. Uh, then, then you need to change the elevation like 3100. Uh, let's check it was clashing with any other. Uh, it is clashing with a little bit with that one. Okay, so she can say like 30175, and then oh, we can we can uh, we can connect these two. Okay, so just connect like this. So it is connected like that. Okay, so the clearly uh, that clash is also avoided. And and then once you've done that one, you can join with the uh, this pipe, these two pipes. So just uh, need to be connect this one. Just selecting this one and connecting to this pipe. So it was not connecting with this one. Yeah, this is connected, and this one also you can connect it with this line. So you can see it. It is again. It is clashing with the beam. So then, then we just need to add just add this one view up to here, and we can say like uh, this. We can move it a little bit off from here, right? So just uh, move this one, up to the, avoiding that clashes. So just do it like that. So the all the pipe connections uh, and even the if it's closing like that, so you can uh, avoid the clashes like this. More bend is coming, so. Um, here i think it is cla clashing with this one right so it was not possible so if if it's possible then you can move the pipe like uh, uh, something uh, you can just uh, move it over here uh, we just try to select this one select uh, this one I'm just uh, moving this one up to here and then here you can avoid this clashes clearly clear perfect so this is the one method like uh, we can avoid the clashes uh, with the pipe each pipes and everything and the drawing uh, how to draw the pipe i will i'll make a more uh, video about uh, uh, the pipes and everything upcoming uh, days thanks for watching thank you thanks for watching if you like my video please subscribe my channel it's related to autocad and rivet thanks for watching thank you